a video about uh, inserting the percutaneous S1 screws, they are harder than people initially believe. And mostly the reason for that is that we don't have a, the correct structure of the pedicle. Even though pedicle is really huge in S1, visualization can be sometimes difficult. That makes it uh, harder to put as well. In most of the AP views, you don't get a good uh, 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 down the barrel view of the S1 pedicle as you get for the um, L5, L4, and L3. Now, the idea is here to, um, even in open surgery, to identify the notch and uh, go at the angle of the um, end plates. So practically, once you find this notch, you go and you mostly, you have to go more lateral than you think. In the MIS, in the percutaneous screw, practically what you see is the border of the L5. Just continue that. If you continue that, then all of a sudden you see this big structure here. That is the pedicle. So mostly you have to be further out and further down than you think on the views. And here, I most of the time I start my pedicle screws actually here, to the starting point when I'm on the bone. And here, I am, I'm here when I'm on the bone. You see the notch again. You see the notch here in the x-ray, and this is the same notch here. You wanna, once you, one of my initial mistake was I was too far up and too far medial. So rather instead of this, you be, should, should be rather like this. In, in that gives you a good kind of view. Uh, and so you're starting here and here. Another thing is if the iliac crest doesn't give you a good uh, trajectory for the pedicle screw, don't worry about it. Instead of the pedicle screw, put the Aylor screw. Just so imagine the iliac crest is here and you don't get that angle. You just go more medial, start the same place, but instead of this way, you go along the iliac crest and, and in the trajectory of the Aylor and you put a so-called Aylor screw. You imagine as well that, you know, in a pedicle screw, the angle is along the end plate of the L S1. In the Aylor screw, the angle is much more steep because the ending point is supposed to be here. You will be able to see the Aylor in the films in the lateral view. This is the Aylor. So if you are going to put the Aylor screw, the angle need to be here and aiming out. If you are going to put the pedicle screw, the angle is here along the end plate of the L5 uh, S1, and the angle is going to be like that. Thank you.